my darlings. Today, I am going to show you a video how to make a terrarium. So I want to tell you and remind you that we are in the season of spring. So let me see what it says about spring for you. As the days grow longer, sometimes the storms grow stronger. There's rain on the green grass, rain on the trees, rain on the housetops, but not on me. This is a time for spring where all the flowers are blooming, the butterflies come out, the caterpillars, the rain starts to stop, and there's rainbows. It's time to plant a garden. Will you join me? All right. So I hope you guys will join me in your vocabulary words. Okay, some of the vocabulary words that we have at the end of April, we're going to be saying bye to April today. And we have terrarium, Mother Earth, the environment, and gardening. Over here, I have a beautiful book. For gardening and it's the surprise garden and the author of the book is Zoe Hall we're planting the seeds for a surprise garden can you guess what will grow and we're gonna pretend because last week we grew the seeds this week I'm changing the word to terrarium first if you don't know let's make it a surprise First, we are going to get soil, we're going to rake it, and we're going to weed. My teacher has given us lots of soil and lots of plants. Look at all the different shapes and sizes. Let me show you the little shapes of the plant. We have some ovals. We have some circles. These little plants are called succulents. We are going to plant succulents. We'll put the succulents in the soil one by one. And the color of our succulents are green. Can you see that? Look at the little puppy dog here. It's like Lady Bella. You know how she's always helping us do everything. Then we're going to water the succulent plant and we're going to water our soil, our dirt. And then we're going to wait for it to grow. Soon it will sprout and it'll turn greener and greener and taller and taller. And you guys can get a ruler and measure your terrarium plant. We'll water it. The sun will warm it. Our garden terrarium will grow and grow and it will bloom. Before long, surprise, it will grow so tall. One more page. Here is the longest plant I've ever grown in my terrarium. It is blooming. It's such a big, beautiful plant. The end. All right, so now I'm gonna show you what you need to make a terrarium. And we've been talking all about Mother Earth and recycling, so I have a water bottle. Can you see that? This is a water bottle that you have here. It's empty, and Miss Debbie always recycles your water bottles. And that's where we get all our treats. All the treats that I give you are from the money that we earn to bring it to the recycling plant. So I recycle this, and now I'm gonna show you the soil that I've got. This is the dirt soil or dirt. And we're going to put dirt in here and then we're going to plant our beautiful succulent and you're going to watch it grow and remember we need to make sure it's in a sunny place 
You always talk to it and give it loving words so it knows that it's loved by you and it will grow and blossom. And don't forget to water it. Don't ever water it. When you feel the soil with your fingers and it feels wet, you don't have to water it. Only if the soil, the dirt is dry. Then please take a little cup and put the water in your terrarium. I also want you to know that part of our activity today has a lot of math in it. So we're doing science, we're doing recycling for our mother earth, and now we're going to count. You're gonna help me count how many scoops of soil it takes to fill this recycled water bottle. Are you ready? All right, here's one, count with me one scoop and it makes a mess you guys but don't worry we can always clean it up gardening is messy but it's so much fun two can you count with me two scoops now i'm going for three scoops count with me three okay i'm going to put it down now and i'm going to take these little and i'm going to pat 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 patting the soil in your terrarium helps you to decide, do I need more? Do I need scoop number four? And I think we do. So I'm gonna scoop number four. Can you count with me? Four. One, two, three, and four scoops of soil. And we're only going to have one beautiful succulent for your terrarium. We're gonna stick it in, you guys. We're gonna stick and we're gonna pat. I'm gonna put it down on the table. You might not be able to see me, but now I'm patting it. And then I'm gonna grab the water because this soil is very dry and it needs water. Okay, and look it, isn't it beautiful? You're all going to have this in your love packet, your educational packet this week. You'll have your bottle, and I've already put the sand in it for you, and the dirt or the soil, whatever you want to call it, it it's the same thing, sand, dirt, soil, whatever you'd like. And then you're all going to have your own piece of beautiful succulent from my garden, and please, Always water it and keep it in a sunny place. I want to show you that I didn't make a succulent this week for myself in our garden here at school, but I made this beautiful, beautiful strawberry plant. Isn't she beautiful? And look at that. She's grown one strawberry already. And there's some flowers in here that are going to turn into a strawberry. So I'll have more strawberries. So when you come back to school, you guys are going to help me eat the strawberries, okay? Thank you. And be safe. Wash your hands and stay inside. Stay with your families if you go outside. And right now you can't go on playgrounds. Please keep yourself safe um, because I can't wait to see you again. And please make pictures and videos of your making your terrariums and put them on our website. And please go to Sarah's very, very special video that she made you about making a terrarium too, okay? So here, today's lesson was making a terrarium. Isn't that a big vocabulary word? Can you say that? Terrarium, T-E-R-R-A-R-I-U-M. All right, be safe. And remember, I'm coming tomorrow with Eunice to bring you your love packets. So I hope you'll be home so that I can blow you a kiss and say I love you. Bye.